On this episode of Scott vs. Box, I open up Flying Sushi Kitchen sent to me from Redwood. Sashimi excited. Scott vs. Box! This is Flying Sushi Kitchen sent to me by Redwood. Holy smokes, these are, this is an amazing uh, game. I saw this when I was at Sweet Sweet and uh, this looks so cool and they're nice enough to send me one and now I can't wait to play. You're the sushi chef. Pluck the sushi out of the air with chopsticks and make your order before time runs out. This is how it really happens, folks. Now you can really do it at home. This is what sushi chefs have to deal with every day. The sushi's constantly flying. Uh, and now you gotta catch it with chopsticks. This is so cool. It includes one flying sushi kitchen, flying sushi balls, eight of them, 40 plate tokens, 40 order cards, two ginger pieces, two wasabi pieces, four sets of chopsticks, four chopsticks trainers, and four sushi trays. Batteries are necessary, ages six and up, one to four players. Sorry, number five, get out of here. All right, let's look at the back here. Wow, if you've ever desired to be a sushi chef, now is your chance! In this exciting challenge, this sushi chef must put together full orders by plucking the flying sushi out of the air with chopsticks, and placing them onto the sushi tray before the time runs out! The first, to, the first player to make $25 worth of sushi orders wins. I tell you, when I go get sushi, it's a little bit more than $25, because I'm a pig! Tips and all play cards add to the fun! Uh, wow, this is so cool. And look, there's just a glimpse of what we're about to see here, but let's get into it. Whoa, hey, batteries included. What the what? Wow, it says right here. Look at that. Batteries required, not included. Was that then? Are these sushi? Well, either way, I feel like a lucky boy. All right, let's take a look here. Cool. Oh man, cool, 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 cool. You might have to unscrew some stuff still. Oh, look at that. That's such a cool design. It's got these little gems and stuff on the side. You know, because when it's sushi, you have some delicious gems. So we've got the, uh, the battery placements here, and then we've got all these different bamboo tubes. I wonder if they go in designated ones here. Oh, we've got the plates. This is cool. This is so cool. And then we've got, what else? We've got another bamboo tube. We've got sushi kitchen cards. We got the, the money, we got chopsticks. These seem like they could be actual chopsticks too. Wow, when in the downtime you use this and you eat off it and then you play the game again, you're like, ah, why is this gross and smell like fish? Sorry, I was using the, the game tokens as actual, uh, I was eating off them, I'm sorry, I'm a pig. I'm a pig! And then we've got the sushi balls! Look at those sushi balls! Look at that! We got, we got egg, tamago, aha, uh -huh, yes. I know a couple of them, and uh, Japanese, what was that, uh, tamago? What was that, uh, tamago? What was that, uh, tamago? Uh, that's probably tuna? Oh, I see shrimp. Ebi? Ebi? I'm not sure how to pronounce it exactly, but there's shrimp right there. It's like a little hat. And then, um, I'm not sure what that one would be. Orange? Perhaps it's orange. Uh, uh salmon? Maybe salmon? Uh, salmon? And then, um, oh, the fake crab. Inari? I think that's the, the fake crab meat. And then, yeah, there's the egg. Cool! That's neat. And then we got stuff here. What's this stuff? This was the, oh, we've got wasabi pieces right here. Very spicy, be very careful. And then we've also got ginger pieces. Mmm, delicious ginger. And then uh, these are, I think, where the sushi, uh, the uh, chopsticks go. They rest those there in the meantime, in between the gameplay. And then we've got the plates. Cool. Got the plates, uh, yes, and uh, those go there for right now. And we've got all the money tokens. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a little break right after I pop these open. i set these out down here. Just uh, some cash money. Oh, and we got the cards, don't forget the cards. Then I'll take a little break and I'll put the batteries in so that way uh, we'll be ready and operational like a full sushi kitchen battle station, right? Cards. Look at all the cards, look at all the orders. Okay, be right back. All right, so we got things ready with the batteries and we've got some things here and I'm gonna give a little demonstration on how this game roughly works. I mean, I don't have all the players here with me because I live in a cardboard universe. So let's see, let's put some of these on here. Let's put some of the bamboo tubes. 
here. All right, so we've got these placed on top. All right, there those go. And then we put the ginger pieces on one plate here and the wasabi pieces on the other plate here. You can see that there, uh, the old home screens. And then we're gonna place some sushi on top here. I'll make sure their faces point out so that way everybody sees their half of sushi faces. And we put the sushi here and then we put a sushi here. Okay, I'll put these other ones on this side right here. And then what happens is I got my plate and I gotta fulfill orders. And depending on the card that I pull over, so this is a sushi order. So let me see, the green, I believe, is a regular order. Then there are rush orders, that's the red button. So uh, let's see here, I'm turn it on. And then, so we've got the green button, so I gotta make a sushi order of, uh, uh, let's see, I'm gonna do all five of them. I'm gonna grab all five. So I got, whoa, well, look at it float, do you see him float? Okay, so I gotta get them. I gotta, I gotta catch it. Oh, I got one. Okay, now I gotta put it. Oh, ooh, uh, touch the floor. No big deal. <laughs> uh, people like that. Okay. Oh, uh, uh, oh, oh. So that's the sushi trainer chopsticks because they got a little thing on the end there. No, I'm gonna do it for real. I'm gonna get these. Uh, oh, nope. <laughs> this is tough. I'm gonna get you. No, ah, sushi went flying off the table. Don't eat it. Catch it. Oh, I got it. Oh, see that? That was cool. Then I gotta get a. Uh, well, what else do I gotta get? I gotta get two of these. I gotta get two gingers, and I got them there, but I didn't get all of them. Ah, oh, man, that was tough. So I got two of them. So that's cool. So I'm gonna try again. I'm gonna do a rush order this time. I'm gonna do a, a rush one. I'm gonna put these back up top here. That, man, that's hard to get. It's a little easier to get with these, you know, because you're training and learning, but man, this is tough. So now I'm gonna do a rush order. Here we go. So let's say I pulled another card, and then let me see, there's other challenges. Whoa, there's a challenge of use the opposite hand for this order. All right, so I'll do that, and then on top of that, I'll do a rush order. So that's what I, that's what I gotta do. So a rush order, so here we go, it's it's set on, and rush order. Oh, I gotta do this left-handed. Oh, oh, I cannot use chopsticks with my left hand. Yeah, but that's the game. That's the game, the challenges. Ah, oh, dang it. All right, I'm gonna get this one. Oh, I got it! Oh, this other one, the other one happened to fall in there. All right, we'll, we'll count it for that, right? Let's get in there, there we go. Yeah, yes. Uh, Left-handed sushi, I'll get you. No, oh, God, come on, get, get, ah, oh, no, no. No, I was right-handed, oh! Oh, man, this game is fun. I really like this game. So then we turn it off, and we got a couple more sushi balls to go. Let's try it now with the right hand. Oh, we got to rush order. Oh, you got to get all your friends involved. There's so many players. Up to four players, and it's all about the challenge. Oh, no, they knocked him off. Oh, no, God. I got to be patient. I got to be patient. Whoop. Got it. Yeah, get the tall one. No, I get the tiny one here. Just patience. Patience. No, oh, God's hovering. It's flying. Oh, I got it. I got it. I got it. No. Man, this game's fun. Takes a lot of practice, but that's the fun part. And you're gonna have everybody screaming and hollering. Oh, such a good time. Flying Sushi Kitchen. They fly, they fly, they fly, whoopee. Whew, that was epic. Like all my unboxings. So to be sure to subscribe by clicking right up here. And then also you can watch more Scott vs. Box videos by clicking right over here. And join the notification squad by clicking on that bell. Then you'll know when every unboxing comes. <sighs> Time to do aerobics.